everyone, it's Dragon Butterflies, and this is my new in bulk altar. And yes, I said in bulk. I know this looks like it could be Beltane because of the red altar cloth and the uh, heart shaped god and goddess candles, but uh, it's in bulk, trust me. I know what Sabbath it is, but yeah. Sorry, my dogs are outside the door. Okay, so I'll take you around my altar now. Um, this is my working candle as usual with my chalice. And come time in bulk, this will have milk in it. Because in bulk actually means in milk. So, yeah. And I flipped the god and goddess sides around. Um, this is now the god side, this is now the goddess side. Excuse me one moment. Okay, sorry. My dogs, which are right there, wanted in the room. Alrighty, so. Um, I got a new god candle holder. Um, yeah, well, yeah, I guess there is there is a new candle there from last time you guys saw. Um, these ones are now white. So, um, this is now the god side with... Let me zoom in. And get the lighting. Um, appropriate herbs around his base and the um, offering dishes that were um, on either side before um, these things yeah. the herbs that were in them are now uh, down around the bases same goes for the goddess side I had a few more rose I added a few more rose buds though petals not buds but yeah so um, while well, I'm over here um, Water and Earth are now over here with the candle to the Fae. Um, Isis's candle, her crystal, um, snowflake obsidian for Hecate. Let me focus this camera, it's not focusing. Alright, um, there is Spirit with the little charm that says Partners in Grime on it that me and my best friend have that I got her for Christmas. Um, focus camera. Okay. So, Hecate's candle with Moonstone for Isis and her things down there. And these candles, let me take this one out. These candles are actually not going to be lit because charm candles can get really expensive sometimes. So, and I can't just keep buying them every time I run out. That's just not going to work. So, um, I'm actually going to use this as a pointer now. Um, uh, Hecate's candle and Essence's candle are now there for statue representations. So then we have in the goddess arms the same things, but the feather that was once over here is now there. And it's actually kind of ironic how this worked out. Um, I already had the pine cone and the piece of um, green moss agate in there. Then I added the feather charm. And what's ironic about it is that. Um, Green Moss Agate is one of Hecate's stones. Pinecomb represents Diana, and the feather represents Isis, which are three goddesses that I work with, that I worship, sorry. So, yeah, yeah that kind of worked out great. And then down there are spirits with the garnets, and, oh, shit, 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 shit. All right, well, um, fire and air, sensor, and yeah, my bell and incense for all, in bulk are up there, along with my homestone and the wheel of the year. And over here, my athme is over here now, and my besom is right there. And so yeah, this is my cauldron, uh, the ring of Apuzuli, and then the ring of uh, tea lights with ball and masculine on the mask on the god side. Feminine within the masculine, point on the goddess side, masculine within the feminine. There we go. And this shit is falling off. That is not good. I'm going to put it down now. Alrighty. So yeah. Um, when it is time for in bulk, there will be melted snow water, in, snow water in the bottom here. And this is the fertility candle for in bulk. So yeah, and then the pentacles down here. Um, I think that's everything on this altar.
Yeah. So, um, goodbye and blessed be.